accident luck here, and I'm gonna have to apologize to everybody. I seem to have messed up. Um, I had uh, uploaded um, the UHC videos, and while well, I got into episode four in the uploading process, and I, I wasn't thinking. I, I kind of messed up a little bit here. Um, after I uploaded up or had up to episode four uploaded onto YouTube, I kind of wasn't paying attention and deleted the rest of the footage. So that said, that pretty much means I can't show the rest of it. Luckily, I did show in the um, footage of the um, trailer, the the intro to the video, the, the main things that went on. Um, really the only things that are missing is, um, I think the jump that I made that did a lot of damage was in episode 4. Uh, that's pretty much what ended my whole season. I mean, that jump where I ended up losing something like 4 hearts, uh, that, that pretty much ended and took me out of the whole scenario, especially when I didn't have any golden apples. Um, but what I, uh, did, uh, look at is I was lucky enough that I got a shot on Tarble and was able to knock him off of his, uh, thing he was building coming up across. And I was able to, uh, die at the hand of, uh, Kumar. Now, Luckily, we do have another perspective. Uh, you won't be able to see all of my ends on things, but you'll at least be able to see the final battle. Um, I had originally recorded that um, through, and while I was vanished in fly mode and stuff. That way I kind of show how the whole season ends and who wins and the final battle. Well, because of me deleting that footage, I no longer have that third person aerial view um sad but it's life it happens i'll make sure that this uh issue doesn't occur again in the future but since my final thoughts for the uhc also kind of got wiped out i'm going to go ahead and add them here my final thoughts for the uhc is that it went well um i think a lot of us had a lot of fun um, it was definitely enjoyable. On the next uh, UHC we do, uh, we're actually going to most likely be playing in 1.8. So I definitely suggest that everybody who plans to participate, familiarize yourself with how 1.8 operates. We're also going to be using the uh, command block that puts in the world border for 1.8, and that world border is going to slowly shrink, basically pulling everybody into the middle. Now, if you're not familiar with the world border, please note that if the world border crosses you or you cross it, you're going to take a lot of damage real fast. Once you get outside the world border, it takes something like, oh, I think it's like five seconds to die from full health. So... Yeah, probably not. If you see that world border coming, probably a good idea to get away from it. Um, so that, that'll be going on in the next UHC. <clears throat> probably will be sometime toward the end of the, um, the August. <clears throat> um, it will be on a weekend. Um, from Since I'm not getting a whole lot of input from you guys in the voting area, um, at uh, slash warp vote, it's looking like there's only a couple options that I'm being informed of. Most likely it'll occur on a Saturday again, and most likely it'll be a 2 or 3 o'clock start time. Um, that way it doesn't interfere with other people being able to, um, because some, let's face it, some people live on the west coast, and I know you guys don't like getting up and know what 9, 10 o'clock in the morning to do a UHC. Um, you guys, it's a Saturday. We'll sleep in a little bit. So, yeah, we're going to try to set that up so that 
it will fall around noonish for you guys. Um, that way, you might have to eat an early lunch or something. Um, but yeah, so we'll probably run it somewhere around two, two to three o'clock on um, a Saturday. Um, don't know exactly which Saturday. Uh, you'll be able to find that on the bulletin board once it's uh, finalized. Um, as for the UHC that we just completed, um, I will say this again. It was a lot of fun. We had some hiccups. Uh, we had some issues getting us started, but uh, that was my fault. I'll take responsibility for that. Uh, I wasn't 100% prepared, hadn't fully tested everything out, and the slash jail command ended up being a flop. I know for the next one, it will operate just like any other UHC that you see out there. There'll be the scatter player commands. We're going to most likely be doing teams. Not sure the size of the team. That depends on how many people show up. The normal server map will be put away. Um, basically stored on my computer while we have the UHC map up. It will probably take about two and a half, three hours so that the regular server will be down. And we'll have the UHC map up. And then after that time period, um, I will immediately get the normal, uh, our normal server world reloaded and back in. So, which can take a few minutes, so you'll have to bear with me on that. Uh, typically, it takes about 20 minutes at most to copy all the files over from my hard drive to the system, uh, to the server. So... That's something we'll be working on. That's mainly for the purposes of being able to allow the UHC to work like it's supposed to, such as um, not having to worry about people trying to TP home. You have to check through all the logs to make sure that nobody's setting a home and then going home getting some armor and stuff or putting something in an ender chest and their first goal is to get an ender chest so that they can pull stuff out of their ender chest. It, it just eliminates a lot of problems plus fixes the achievement issue where we ain't got to worry about saying achievements, the achievements just pop off. Um, but yeah, I really enjoyed this season with you guys. Um, again, I'm really sorry that I've deleted the footage. Uh, that won't happen again. Uh, now on, I'll make sure I get everything uploaded to YouTube and set it as private so that it's stored in the system, and then I'll clean up the old files and get rid of them. That way I have room for new videos. Um, we'll say that I'm getting, on a final note, um, another project that I have been working on is a Let's Play. Um, hopefully some of you might be interested in, uh, go ahead and watching that. Uh, give me some input. Let me know what, uh, makes a good Let's Play, what doesn't. Um, and currently it's in a single player world, um, mainly because I don't want to make one on the server and have to deal with all that. Uh, stuff of protection blocks and everything else kind of takes away from the feel of of the let's play. Um, so I am doing it in a single player world for the first season. Um, hopefully by the second season I found a, another group of people that I can uh, work with that also do YouTube videos. Um, but yeah, give me your comments, give me your feedback. Uh, I'd love to hear from you guys on what you think about that. Um, also upcoming, we ha now have the lottery, and I'm going to start putting out a weekly, uh, uh, weekly server update video. So, hopefully those things turn out well. Um, and as far as, I, I think that's pretty much it. Um, thank you a lot, guys, for participating in the UHC. Um, you, it... We had a late start, but it really turned out really well. It was a lot of fun. Enjoyed running around, hunting people. Got a kill. Got killed. <laughs> but overall, it, it was pretty fun. Now, I will say, my death was real simple. Um, in the intro, you see Kumar hit me. And I kind of bounce back, and you, you kind of see my heart flash. My heart's flash for a second in the intro. Well, that hit was the death blow. I cut the clip 
right before it actually showed me actually that sign that says you are dead where it pops up and asks you to respawn I had actually cut the clip right before that showed up so you seen the my entire death you just didn't see the death screen <laughs> because that's exactly what happened um, he had popped in hit me once I tried to get back I hit him once and that was it it was over I was dead um, but either way, thank you for watching. Um, make sure you check out Uni Crafting Guy's uh, channel. He does have the full perspective. I believe he's not going to make the same mistake as me and delete one of the uh, primary parts of the show, or the season. Um, so there will definitely be a link in the description to his next episode. And um, probably like and subscribe uh, if you want to keep track to know when the next videos or video is going to be put out for him um, onto his channel of course and um, it looks like he's putting out one a day so over the next today will probably be episode f he'll be putting out episode six I believe today and then he'll be going with yeah that should be the last episode so this will put me on par with him we'll both be finishing up uh, our last videos sadly um, mine gets to be an explanation of why I can't show you the rest of my videos um, but yeah uh, either way I am glad that you all have watched and enjoyed so far um, thank you for um, viewing it and watching it and Hopefully it was entertaining, and next season I'm going to shoot to make it even better. Um, better commentary, um, of course we're going to be in teams, so hopefully ever, whoever um, whoever's on my team is going to be people who's actually going to communicate, get on Skype, have conversations, blah blah, stuff like that. So, that's the goal, that's what we're shooting for, and um... Yes, we will see you in the Season 2 of the UHC. Have a good one, everyone.